Oil prices spiking after OPEC Plus members announced a cut to production by an additional 1 million barrels per day. Just taking a look at what Wall Street analysts are saying about this surprise announcement, they are basically now expecting oil to go up through the end of the year. Yes, of course. Whenever you increase the price of the uh, the, the base product, crude oil, that goes into making gasoline, it's, it's going to get worse. What has been a very slow-burning cold war between Saudi Arabia and uh, the United States. We have to see how this OPEC news sort of trickles in, whether it will create winners and losers again based on uh, the rise in oil prices. There's some people are pointing to this cut and saying, well, look, it's going to be taking so much uh, production out of the market through the rest of this year. Regardless, OPEC is focused on stability in the market here. They don't want choppiness. They don't want volatility. Elevated energy prices, another recession factor there. Of course, the big question is what this means for the Fed's fight against inflation. It actually sort of confirms that we're likely to see uh, two 25 basis point hikes with uh, oil prices likely to be uh, moving higher. Inflation will continue to be uh, a thorn in the Fed's side. I think the real question is how deep will the recession be? Uh, and I think one of the main factors will be how long does the Fed continue to raise rates?